David Settle from KOWB standing next to a couple former Plainsmen standouts, Garrett Warden and Frank Crum. They're getting set for action in the Shrine Bowl All-Star Football Game of Wyoming up in Casper on June 9th. Uh, I'll start uh, with you, Garrett, since you're closer to me. Uh, how excited are you to play in this All-Star Football Game? Oh, very excited. It's a big honor being accepted to play in it. And lately I've been just doing a little more DN work and I'm really missing football. Yeah. What about for you, Frank? You looking forward to yeah, it? Yeah, I'm excited to get to get back around high school guys that one last time that i just grown to know over the past four years. And, just ready for that. I'll put you on, on the spot. Is there anybody in 4A that you guys played against that you're really looking forward to playing with on the South team here in the last couple of years? Anybody that kind of comes to mind that was maybe kind of one of those pesky nuisances as an opponent, but you're like, okay, he's on my team now at all? Uh, never, person I never really played with, but really want to play with is uh, uh, Dawson. I forgot his first name. Theo? Theo? No, the younger oh, one. Oh, Josh Dawson. Yes. Yeah, Star Valley. Yeah. Okay. I watched a lot of his highlights and I'm really looking forward to it. From the them. north. I know it's not the south, but Blaine. Not uh, sure. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, you guys are going to be teammates here in yeah. just a little bit. Uh, how has that transition gone for you? I know that you did compete in, in track, but mm -hmm. how is kind of getting ready, building up for college football? Uh, I mean, we always have been competitors from freshman year between basketball and football. And these past couple months, we've grown to become not more so competitors but teammates so that's been nice to nice to do yeah what have you been doing just individually on your own trying to gear up to get ready for the college uh, game just lifting and obviously track on my footwork i just keep doing that and mainly just lifting what are you guys looking forward to the most in terms of the experience behind the scenes when it comes to the shrine bowl uh just hanging out with the other players because we really i've never really hung out with any other players outside of laramie and so i'm really looking forward to that and People that have like gone to the Shrine Bowl and like talked about it have said how great it's been like meeting other people and so. Yeah. Anything like, that comes to mind for you, Frank? Uh, just create new friends that probably last a long time. All right. So what does the South got to do with a couple of Army boys heading heading the charge on the O line and D line to get a victory against the North? Because it seems like the North has kind of had our number lately. Yeah, here. that's the theme. The North always wins, but <laughs> I think I think between one A and four A, it'll just be a or toss up to be honest, I don't know who's real more dominant in my opinion. Yeah, stop the run, I feel like, because I know their line yeah. up north is good. Yeah. What are you guys looking forward to in terms of the experience visiting the Shriners Hospital? Because that's one of the first things you guys actually get to do coming up early next week. Yeah, I think that's a big honor and like that's a big spot to be in and it's just it's I'm very grateful to like to be able to go do that. Yeah, just meeting a lot of kids and just trying to make a difference. All right, well, good luck to both of you. Yeah, nice to have Laramie representation in the yeah. Shrine Bowl. The Shrine Bowl game is June 9th at Cheney Alumni Field in the Toronto County High School, and Casper is an afternoon kickoff.